H3, H3, Ela Klein, Ethan Klein, and the super pregnancy. Basically, Ela is about to give birth. I was just watching their uh, she's about to give birth video on Ethan's channel, and uh, I had some inputs that I want to go over as well that I have here actually written down. We're going to go over her video first real quick of them uh, announcing the pregnancy, the triplets. And uh, yeah, we'll go from there and we'll we'll chit chat about that in a second. So this is where Ela talks about uh, the, the possibility of triplets and that there is two babies in her womb. So let's take a look here real quick. It, it was kind of shitty not to have you there because I was like shaking. I was like, oh my God. Yeah, when you called me, you were hysterical. <laughs> um, so they did an ultrasound and she was like, well, I see two circles. And I was like, oh shit. And she was like, yeah, one looks good. That one also, I think, looks good. And then she was like, and there may be a third one. <laughs> and I was like, oh, what? <laughs> so I saw the ultrasound. But she did say the third one is a lot smaller and there's a chance it's just liquid or something. I think it's a I I I was I think it's 3. <laughs> So basically all of that is old news, right? That was like eight months, nine months ago, whatever, when they were talking about the pregnancy stuff, right? And Ela called it the super pregnancy and whatever, because she was doing the hormone therapy and all of that stuff, right? Having a baby for them was a struggle. And I actually remember a point, I think, where Trisha was like actually relentlessly attacking them uh, because Ela couldn't get pregnant and she needed the hormone therapy, right? And Trisha's a pretty much a nut bar, right? So, like, obviously that pregnancy is pretty miraculous. And, you know, congratulations to them for having the ability to have more children, right? So that is absolutely insane. But in this most recent video that I was watching, they are talking about the baby, uh, the, the babies, whatever, as a singular one baby instead of, you know, two or three. So we're going to take a look and watch that as well. So here they're talking about the baby as yeah. one. So let's take a look. Don't you dare make this about you. Okay. Because <laughs> I didn't just gain weight. I have a living creature inside of me. Right, See, a living creature, singular. Right? So I'm, I'm thinking something else might have happened. And at this part in the video as well, she's about to show off her stomach. So we'll take a look here. Again. Just get show it off. Show off the. Yeah, well, let's just show off the at stomach. It. I mean, because it's so big. Maybe if you step back. Right here. See, and it does look big, right? She definitely does look big, but she's always been like smaller, right? Ethan uh, is the the bigger fellow, obviously, right? She's always been small. His legs. His legs, right, right here. Bruce's legs. There's a foot here or something foot that's there. sticking out his head is here legs and i think it's like like that right so that means that means maybe bruce is actually a cannibal and absorbed his other siblings and the thing too is bruce has uh like cysts or something on his kidneys so his kidneys aren't uh aren't working that good so maybe bruce is trying to snatch them kidneys right that'd be crazy because they haven't talked about the twins in months they're talking about bruce the baby uh singularly and uh you know they they haven't said anything else about twins or triplets or anything like that and there is lots of cases where twins get absorbed uh by you know their their siblings or whatever right so basically when bruce is born He's going to be the ultimate Klein, right? Super Bruce is going to uh, tear out of the labia like some sort of superhero baby. Rawr! Just flex on him, right? He's going to have a, a six-pack abs and already have a full set of hair, obviously. It's just definitely interesting to see either that or they clickbaited the hell out of everybody in the very beginning and most people forgot. And really and truly, it's actually pretty common well, it's kind of common that twins do actually get absorbed, right? According to this article that I'm reading right here, 
According to one study, about 36% of twins' pregnancies experience vanishing twin syndrome, which is where the one twin uh, basically miscarries and then gets absorbed by the other one. Uh, It also occurs in around half of multiple pregnancies or pregnancies where a woman carries more than one baby. So that's pretty crazy, right? If it was triplets, uh, according to this, it seems like it's more likely to happen, right? So, I mean, Bruce might have absorbed uh, his siblings like some sort of lunatic. Um, so either this baby comes out a superhero or a super villain uh, with the funding of multimillionaires. I guess we'll find out in the future, right? Ela is actually about to give birth on Monday uh, is her due date, right? And I think they were talking in the video saying like after two weeks, uh, the doctors will like induce her into labor and then she'll give birth. So basically baby Klein is on the way. And yeah, I just thought it was interesting that they haven't talked about the twins or the triplets in quite a while. And then in this video, they're referring to the baby as, you know, singular. And, you know, they've only discussed the one name. But they almost changed the name uh, because Ethan accidentally revealed it. Yeah. So Ethan, you know, gave the name out. And they almost changed the name. Now Baby Bruce is on the way. Buff Baby Bruce. BBB. Buff Baby Bruce. BBB. The three Bs for you know buff baby bruce and that's that's basically it for this video i appreciate you guys watching uh i think the next video is going to be a bit of a doozy if i look into this person and uh i see what i think i'm gonna see so stay tuned for that now let's use the next couple minutes to talk about me because i am excited about something yes sir these two teeth right here are ugly you can't see it usually on camera but but I will go ahead and show you what they look like uh, because, you know, because I'm disgusting. Um, so, yeah, if you're easily um, if you're easily disturbed, I would suggest looking away uh, now because. Oh, look at how white they are. OK, you guys literally can't see it. There you go. You see those two front teeth. Uh, maybe if I turned down my brightness a little bit. But you see those two front teeth? They're bad. They, they look way worse in person, to be honest, right? It's the camera that's making them look nicer. Um, but the dentist is fixing them. So that's huge for me. That's been an insecurity for a very long time, at least like six, seven years, right? They've been like that. No matter how much I brush, I can't clean them, right? So I've been going to the dentist. Your boy is getting his teeth fixed, okay? So that's huge. And I get to keep my natural teeth. I was thinking implants were going to be necessary and all that stuff that I can't afford. So, yeah, that's that's basically me. Uh, I'm going to be learning to drive soon. So that's cool, right? Hopefully, anyways, if we can get this car fixed. That's another issue. Uh, but I haven't been working, so I really got to get my license so I can get another job. Um, and then, yeah, we'll go from there. So that's basically it for this video. It's probably a decent length video. Uh, if you've made it this far, thanks for listening to me. Uh, there's a subscribe button right down here. Go ahead and click it, man. I would definitely appreciate it. And we'll, uh, we'll definitely see you in the next video.